Hey, how's it going, felines? My name is CJ or Cold James. Welcome back to another video. I hope you're having a great day. Do you like music? Are you always wondering what kind of music Cole plays in the background? Well, look no further. For real though, I have been procrastinating on this video for a long time, longer than they should have. And you guys are always asking me what kind of music I listen to, what are the songs I listen to, or can I have a playlist of your music? And I thought today I would make kind of a short video since I'm leaving for California really soon. I thought, you know what? Now is a great time to make this video. I have nothing really going on. I'm packing up my PC. I'm getting ready to leave. So you know what? Why not share some music with you guys? Airplane rides, car, long car rides, doing dishes. There's always a different activity that calls for different types of music. And today I thought we'd kind of show you guys and uh, bring into the world of uh, Cold James and kind of show you what I enjoy listening to on a daily basis for whatever, you know? Early in the morning, waking up when you're feeling tired as crap and you don't want to move a muscle. What can really get you going in the morning? Or when you're doing chores around the house and you want something to lift your spirit up. Or maybe when you just really want to maybe contemplate life. Everyone's like, oh yeah, Cole's got that sad nibba hours on lock. No, I'm serious though, like there is, Music for every type of mood and every type of situation and whatever you're feeling, music is a great way to cope with anything. Honestly, I've 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 uh, I've really got through a lot of hardships and heartaches with music. I know it sounds cliche, but music is a way to kind of escape reality for a while and put your mind somewhere else. I, I consider music to be a drug. It sounds really stupid, but it's a it is something that really um, can do a lot a lot of different things to you and make you feel different ways. And the fact there's so much of music is beautiful. Today I'm going to show you guys some of the artists that I listen to, some specific songs. I'm not, I'm not going to go over all of them. However, I will leave a link down in the description below in this video of a playlist with pretty much all the songs that I listen to. You guys have been wanting this for a long, long, long time. You wanted my playlist. I decided today I'd make one. I'd be like, come on Cole, stop being lazy. Put together a little playlist and I'll keep adding to it as well when I find more music and you guys can listen to the stuff that I listen to. Most of the stuff is royalty free, meaning that there is no copyright on it, but these are independent artists and uh, and I really, I don't know, there's something about it. I, I just really like, I call them freelance artists, the ones that don't really care too much about copyright, they more care about getting their music to the world and that's kind of what I'm doing right now. I'm, I'm helping them out in a way. So yeah, we're gonna go over a couple artists, a couple songs, and I'll leave the rest up to you guys to explore down in the description below. I'll have a playlist, so let's get into it. The first person I want to highlight in this video is DJ Quads. This has to be one of my favorite artists on the market as we speak. If you really want uplifting, cheery, fast beat music, high BPM type beats, and if you also love the aesthetic of old timey songs, like I'm talking about 1990s, 1980s, 1970s, if you love that kind of stuff and you want to hear that with new age type beats, DJ Quads is the way to go. He has a beautiful blend of old timey sounds mixed with new time beats and it it's pleasing to the ear. I don't know how how to describe it other than that, it's just it's beautiful. He does mainly fast beat songs, um, but there are some songs that he has kind of slower, more chill vibes. One of my absolute all time favorite songs by DJ Quads is A Little Dream. It really just makes me feel happy and, and fun, feels like I want to go. I don't know, throw water balloons at friends or something. It's just a really nice vibe. A lot of the songs give off various vibes. For instance, Spring Feeling gives a very happy type vlog vibe. Somewhere where you would go during maybe springtime, going on a road trip with your friends. I don't know, it has a very um, exploration type vibe. <laughs> Last but not least, if you enjoy really mellow type music with piano, very low BPM songs, then there are some. There are they are far few in between, but DJ Quad does have some very relaxing songs. WWW is a thing is definitely one of those songs. The next artist I have to highlight is definitely 
Flamingosis. Now, at first, I thought it was Flamingosis, like a flamingo, and then Flamingosis. Apparently, his dad did frisbee throwing professionally. He did, like, like an art form. He would, like, spin it around on his body. It is insane. I can't even get into detail, but he has uh, an interview about that where I got the name. Flamingosis is basically the move that his dad did. That was his specialty move that won a lot of championships, I guess, or something. I don't know. I'd say the majority of Flamingosis songs makes you feel like you're in the city. You got somewhere to go. You're on the move. You're always busy. It's just one of those type of vibes. You get when I, when I at least when I, whenever I hear them. Similar to DJ Quad's, Flamingosis actually takes a lot of samples from old type songs, like from the 70s, 60s even, or 80s, and brings them into the new age, and I really love that artists do that. One of my all-time favorite tracks by Flamingosis is Want Me, or Need Me. It has like two different titles, I believe. This makes you feel like you're, you can, you're going away on a secluded beach vacation. You and three friends, drinks, really great vibes, great music, and you're there surfing and just really enjoying the atmosphere. One thing I believe I like about Flamingos is the most, and I think it's why he's one of my favorite artists of all time, is that he adds lyrics to his, his music. Unlike DJ Quads, which he has great beats, Flamingos adds very nice lyrics. Of course, he repeats them over and over here and there. You can kind of hear the same lyrics over and over again, but they're very relaxing. And I, I don't know what it is. Some of them just really make you, ha you just want to smoke a fat blunt and just go... With the biggest smile on my face, I, I, honestly, I, I can't not listen to his music and smile, even for more relaxing type songs that aren't as fast paced. Down for the Fifth Time is definitely an example, a great example of that. <laughs> Starting off with a great beat and then slowly transitioning into some lyrics and you just feel like you want to skate down Hollywood Boulevard. It is honestly a really great laid back song. Another one that I really, really cherish by Flamingos is, is an 8-Ball Affair. This song, uh, again, it has amazing lyrics, great beats. The, the beat progresses as well. It's a very progressive beat. It doesn't stay the same. It switches up too. And honestly, all of his songs are very unique and different. So I definitely recommend you guys give this song a listen and the rest of his songs a listen as well. <laughs> Last but not least, we're gonna go over one more artist that I really wanna highlight. These are only three of the many that I listen to on a daily basis. Anyway, the last one is Jin Sang. Basically, this artist comes out with very chill, laid back, I guess you could call it late night vibes. If you're in the city, you're walking in the street by yourself, you know, it's there's neon lights around you, it's a very quiet, peaceful night, you know. This is the kind of music you want to listen to. I've, uh, I definitely have to say, and a big thank you if, I don't know if Jin Sang's ever watched this, but I did w listen to a lot of his music, and honestly, it has really helped me through a lot of tough times, where I'll, I'll be feeling, like, I don't know, sorry for myself or something, I don't know, just, that's just some example I could come at the top of my head. And I, honestly, yeah, I've been in my feels a lot, and this type of music really helps me kind of think about what I'm doing and kind of get out of that funk. So honestly, this type of music is very chill, laid back. So if you really like this stuff, then I think you're gonna really enjoy this type of music. Affection by Jin Sang is probably one of my favorite songs by him. It kind of makes you self-reflect on your life. And it makes you very chill. It's just a very good vibe. Anyway guys, that is gonna do it for the video today. Thank you for watching. This has been a little bit of a music review. What do I listen to? You guys are always asking that. And by the way, no, none of these artists paid me to shout them out or tell them, tell you guys about them. I'm personally taking the time out of my day to do this because I really like these artists and I listen to them every day. So I thought, why not? Tell you guys who I listen to. You guys have been biting at the bit for me to do this. 
So yeah, here it is. Anyway, I'll probably make a little small playlist down below. I'll keep adding songs to the playlist. That way, if you guys want to hear what I'm listening to or what I, what's kind of been in my ears these last couple weeks or the last couple days, you guys will know. Thank you for watching. My name is Cole James or CJ. I will catch you guys for tomorrow's video. Look all these artists up that I mentioned. I'll have more, like I said, in the playlist. So, so you guys can have plenty of new music to listen to as the week progresses. So you guys can check that out and uh, give that a listen. Have an awesome day. My name is Cole James or CJ. Be an influencer or be influenced. Either way, live your life to the fullest. My name's Cole and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.